afternoon baseball here on the show. Coming up, we've got a good matchup in store between the Pittsburgh Pirates and the Washington Nationals. Ready now, Kevin Newman. He will lead this one off today. Two and one. Fly ball heading for the alley. And he's going to have extra bases right out of the chute today. And he's looking for three right out of the gates today. And he'll get there as he kicks off the ball game with a triple. Got accepted. The left fielder, Adam Frazier. Standing in now, Adam Frazier. One and two. Scherzer is way up there among active pitchers in terms of career wins. He's earned more than 170 of them in his time at the big leagues. Lifted down the line in left. Soto has it, and I'd be surprised if they send the runner. And he will score on the sacrifice fly as he's in with our first tally of the ball game. Up next for the Buckos, Brian Reynolds. A couple of hits for him in four trips to the plate last night. And a fastball blew it right by him, and there are two down. Josh Bell, the next to hit. First chance for him here after appearing as a pinch hitter in the game last night. 2 1 pitch is a fastball swung on and missed 2 and 2. Fouled off. It's going to be back to some serious T work if he can't put that pitch in play right in his wheelhouse. A bouncer up the middle. Throw on to first gets him and the side is retired. A speedy Trey Turner digs in now. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Pulls this one in the air out to left. Left fielder giving chase. He's there and records the first down. And now for Washington, Adam Eaton, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. The 1-1. One, one. Lifted the other way to left center. Left fielder is on the move. He can't get there as it falls in. Into the box now, Howie Kendrick. But he won't draw a throw. That's taken for ball four, and it's first and second now with one away. Eaton on second. Kendrick at first, one gone. Three balls and a strike to the Nationals' left fielder. This is on the ground over to first. And that's through into right field for a base hit. And a good throw is going to hold that runner at third. So they're loaded now with only one away. The right fielder, Eric. In now, Eric Thames. Thames behind one and two. Strike three called. My gracious, what a pitch with the bases loaded, and there are two away now. Started to go. Did he hold up in time? Yes, says the first base umpire. It's ball three now. Payoff pitch on its way. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Frazier is there as he makes the catch, and they'll tightrope out of danger as he strands the bases loaded. Second inning set to go, and that'll bring up Colin Moran. Hit hard to the right side. 
And that is through into right field for a single. That is it. The right fielder. Gregory Polanco. So now to the plate, Gregory Polanco. And a changeup swung on and missed for the first out. Into the box, Kevin Kramer. He's hitless in the series so far. High and wide, two balls and a strike. Sometimes it can be difficult for a pitcher. You're facing a guy that's not known to be a big stick in the lineup. Sometimes the toughest thing is to be aggressive and throw strikes. Pulled toward right center field. Eaton is after it. He makes the running play. Two down. Jacob Stallings will be the next hitter. Looking for better results than last night when he went 0 for 4 in that one. No contact there, and it's one and two. A runner on first with two away. Weak roller right side. And he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over. Last half of the second set to go, and that'll give way to the third baseman as Dribble Cabrera. And that's into the corner, a foul ball in right. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. Grounder down the line at third. And this will stay inside the third base bag, a fair ball. And he'll pull into second here with nobody out. Stepping in now, Ryan Zimmerman in the air down the line in left. Left fielder giving chase, but this will land untouched. No one out with a runner at second. That's popped up. Polanco coming on, but he can't make the play as it finds the outfield grass. And they'll get it in quickly. It's first and third now with nobody out. Into the box, Max Scherzer. Swinging a soft liner. Base hit, and that'll get a run in. At the plate, Trey Turner. Count even at two and two. From the stretch. Adam Eaton is on deck. He'll hit next. Now the three and two pitch. There's a swing and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. But that'll stay in the park as it's off the wall. And no sense risking anything here as the bases will be loaded now with still nobody out. Into the box now. Adam Eaton. Swing and a liner. And this is down for extra bases and it might chase everybody home. It's cut off. So all three runners are in to score. Now that is the second baseman, Howie. In now, Howie Kendrick. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. These guys hitting aren't in first place by accident. They excel at getting out to early lead, so this is a big moment in this game. If they're able to lengthen this lead any more in this inning, they're going to be in really good shape to come away with a win today. And he misses here for ball four. Already two walks surrendered in his first couple of innings of work. Juan Soto to the plate now. One for one after a single this first time up. Yeah, and they take another single right here. That third base coach is dying to wave his arms. I wouldn't be surprised if anything hit hard through the infield. He's going to wave it. And he's out. Beautiful throw home to cut down the run. The right fielder, number nine, 
At the plate now, Eric Thames. Hit hard on the ground to second. And that'll get by into center field for a base hit. And they'll add one more to the lead. It's now a 5-1 to one ball game. Now batting, Hector. So now to the play, Kurt Suzuki. Hit on the ground out to short. He's got it. There's one. On to first, and he really paid the price at second base, but it's a double play, and the inning is over. And now it's the Pirates pitcher, Mitch Keller, as we are all set to begin the third inning in this one. Lots of baseball left in this one as we're still early on, but you don't want to fall too far behind. They're already down by a bundle, and one of the things you want your leadoff guy to get on and set the table for the big boys to start driving in some runs. Fouled away. To two balls and two strikes now. Line to shortstop, and there's one away. Into the box now, Kevin Newman. He smacked a triple and later scored his first time around. And now a curveball that's low and in the dirt for a ball. It's two and one. Now a swing and a fly ball. But this will land out there just foul. Lucky he got a piece right there. He was definitely late on that pitch after seeing a previous off-speed pitch. Fastball didn't miss by much, and it's a full count now, three and two. And he lost him here on three-two as that pitch misses. It's ball four. And that'll bring in Adam Frazier. Picked up an RBI on a sack fly in his first appearance. On the ground is short. This could be two. Turner has it to second for one. And the throw is off target there, so he'll reach first base safely. Center fielder, number 10. Stepping up to the plate, Brian Reynolds. He'll swing it from the left side right here. More of a comfortable side from the left side. Puts the ball in play. More of a contact hitter from the left side. Might have grown up being a natural left-handed hitter. Throw to first will get him easily, and the side is retired. Bottom of the third now, and that'll bring in the switch hitting former All Star as Drupal Cabrera. Ground ball right side, straight into the shift. Newman fields it cleanly, and a good throw gets him one gone. Here's Ryan Zimmerman now. He singled and scored in his first appearance in this one. Zimmerman. Grounded to the right. And that is going to sneak on through into right. It's a one out single. To the plate now, Max Scherzer. On a line to shortstop. But the runner is back in time to avoid the double play. Here now is Trey Turner. Grooves the fastball there. This is hit high and deep out to straightaway center field. And this one will bounce into the wall. Zimmerman rounds the corner and is headed home. Safe at the plate. And it's now a 6-1 to one ball game. Stephen Brault is going to come on to pitch here. And in just the third inning, you have to think he'll be asked to eat some innings. Into the box, Adam Eaton. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Reynolds has it for out number three. All set for the start of the fourth. And digging into bat next, the big bat of Josh Bell. Clearly off with his timing on that one, a swinging strike. Well, 
Good swing on a tough pitch, and he'll stick around to see another one. Count remains full. And he can only battle for so long as he's finally set down here after an eight pitch at bat. The third base Ready for another Colin. chance. Colin Moran, Moran. A base hit in his first trip. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Eaton on the move. He tracks it down and makes the play to record the second out. So bases are empty here with two gone. And the left-handed hitting outfielder Gregory Polanco bats next. The 1-1. One -one. Swing and a ball line down in the left field corner. But this is going to get foul. The 1-2. Is a wave and a miss. He struck him out. Ready to go in the bottom of the fourth. And that'll give way to the veteran second baseman, Howie Kendrick. Even though they're up by a boatload early on in this one, you can't get complacent and get lazy. They got to keep the gas pedal down because this team that they're playing can strike and score a lot of runs, too. Hot shot to third and handled for the first out. So the bases are empty with one man gone. And digging into bat next, the ever dangerous Juan Soto. Now the one and one pitch. Right side, defense aligned perfectly. Newman's got it. And there are two away now. Striding in now for the Nets, Eric Thames. He came through with an RBI single in his last at bat. Here's the one and one delivery. Maybe too much break on the slider. Two and one. Into the corner and slicing foul. Six runs, 11 hits, and no errors so far for the Nationals. And another foul ball. And it's fouled away. A two and two count. Here's the pitch. Hit hard down the right field line. And that is off the wall, but in foul territory. Foul ball. Change up taken for ball three, well below the zone. Hey, this guy's a hard guy to put away. He's fouling off some tough pitches. Two two count. And he just seems to keep hanging right in there. He spoils another one and will do it again. Hit hard on the ground to the right. Newman brings it in. Throw on to Bell at first and the side is retired. So digging in now, Kevin Kramer comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. This one doesn't look good so far. Down by a boatload as we enter the middle innings. It's about time they get something going. And the last thing you want to do is fall behind where you have to score a bunch in the 8th and ninth inning. And that one skips up over the wall for a ground rule double. Next to the park, the catcher, Jacob. Stepping in now, Jacob Stallings. And a half swing here, but this is in there for a cold strike, too. Fastball swung on and missed for the first out. So here now is the pitcher, Stephen Brault. The first dad bat of the game for him here in the fifth as he was a late entrant into this one. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Soto will get there with ease as he puts it away for out number two. The throw is wild and it gets away. 
So the lineup flips over and digging in. Kevin Newman, runner in scoring position with Sugan. Newman. Here now the 2 2. Swing and a liner. Foul. Even at two balls and two strikes, here's the pitch. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. Eaton going back at the track. And just short of a home run, this ball's off the wall. Now back, left fielder, Adam Frazier. Standing in now, Adam Frazier. Way inside with that one, a pretty easy take there. Line to the right side. And that'll get by and on through towards the wall. He'll get it into second. Throw to second, but he's in there as a run will score on the play as well. Now back, the center fielder, Brian Reynolds. At the plate now, Brian Reynolds can't keep the weight back, and he falls behind one and two. Three runs, five hits, and no errors so far for the Pirates. Nope. Maybe trying to back him up a bit there with the fastball. And he lays off, so it's full now, three and two. For the guy in the mound, this is one of those innings where nothing comes easy. He's thrown a bunch of pitches, and this A.B. hasn't been any different. Definitely laboring at the moment. Line to the right side, but foul. Another payoff pitch. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Eaton is under it. And that's the third out. <laughs> Stepping into the box, Kurt Suzuki. He's hitless in his two at-bats so far. The 1-1 one -one home. This one's down to third. Throws in time, and that's out number one. Here now is his dribble Cabrera. This is in the air out to left field. Frazier is in his tracks now as he makes the catch for out number two. Stepping into the box, Ryan Zimmerman. Two base hits, both singles to this point. Zimmerman. Now the one and one pitch. Two out, nobody on. Two balls and two strikes to count to Ryan Zimmerman. Ground ball sent back up the middle. Newman fields it cleanly. Off balance throw gets him. Nice play there as the side is retired. Leading off the inning, Josh Bell as they'll look to get something going here and even this game up. 1-1. Strike two swinging. Down is one and two. Now a ball lined to the left side, but foul. Here's a drive out toward left center field. Around first, digging for two. And it's a good start to the inning for the Bucks. It's a leadoff double. Now batter, third baseman, Colin Moran. In now, Colin Moran. One and two now. Oh, 
open to send him packing. Pitch on its way. A swing and a miss on a ball way out of the zone, and there's one away. Settling in now, Gregory Polanco. No hits to this point. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. Skied into straightaway right. Thames will drift over to his left a few steps as he takes it for the second out. Digging in and looking for more, Kevin Kramer. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at-bat with another big hit right here. Yeah, he did a great job to go down and get that one, his last at-bat. But I got to think they're going to pitch him up, maybe elevate. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. But that'll hit off the wall in left center. As he arrives at second without a play, as a run also comes in to score, making it a two-run ball game. So now to the plate, Jacob Stallings. Nope. And that misses ball Your four. So it's first and second now with two out. Jose Osuna will start to loosen up in the on-deck circle as he'll bat with two on and two out here. Two men are on with two men out. A bouncer to the left side. On to first, and that'll do it as they manage to not let this inning get out of hand. Richard Rodriguez enters to do the pitching in the bottom of the sixth. Number 48. Starlin Castro is going to come off the bench as he'll be asked to lead off the bottom of inning number six. Slider is right there. 83 on the gun. It's one and two. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and that's the first out. So the Nats lineup turns over, and to the plate, Trey Turner. So far, two for three in this one. And he strikes him out as well. So make it back-to-back -back punch outs here to the first two men he faces out of the bullpen. A 1-1 home. Swung on and missed, and that's strike two. A swing and a miss as he chased with two strikes, and that will retire the side. Rowena Salias is on to pitch from the bullpen now to start inning number seven. Number 55. All set for the start of the inning, and that'll bring in the second baseman, Kevin Newman. Even though we're moving into the back end of this game, they're only down by a couple of runs. You know that old slogan, a bloop and a blast? They could certainly use that right now. The one-two. Line drive to center field. Eaton is right there, one down. So here's Adam Frazier. He doubled earlier in the game, one for two to this point. Into the windup, here comes the 2 2 pitch. Every base runner in a close game like this really matters, so you can't afford to be giving out free passes this late. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. He's around first, heading for two. And he'll reach second now with one away. The center fielder, number 10, Brian Reynolds. Into the box now, Brian Reynolds. Two and one. On the ground to third. Cabrera's up with it. Throw on to first, two gone. So here's the cleanup hitter, Josh Bell. He came across to score after doubling in his last at-bat. Well, he got a good pitch to hit last time up. Looked for it up in the zone and didn't miss it. Those are the pitches you only get maybe 
once an A-B, maybe once a game, maybe once a week. So he certainly capitalized on it last time. Now the 2-1. Three ball, one strike. Called a strike and it's full three and two. You know he wants to end this inning right here on three and two, but I don't think we'll see him lay one in on the next pitch there with a base open to work with. And he fouls this one off. Hit out towards second. There to get it is Kendrick. They'll whip this one to first in time, and that ends the inning. Robbie Erlin gets the call from the pen to take over on the mound and start the home seventh. Bottom of the inning now, and set to go is the second baseman, Howie Kendrick. This is line to left. But he'll hardly need to move out there in left as this is hauled in for the first out. Here now is Juan Soto. Two hits and three at-bats for him in this one. The 1-1. Swing and a liner. Foul. The 1-2. And this ball is popped up, drifting back behind the mound. And there's out number two. Now at the plate, Eric Thames. He was retired via the ground ball last time up. The 1-1 one, one home. Bases are empty here with two men out. There's a swing and a high drive into left center field. A ball that's carrying. And he makes a nice catch on the track as that ends the inning. Sean Doolittle will come on now to make his 30th appearance of the year so far. Ready to begin the eighth, and that'll bring up Colin Moran. Even at a ball and a strike, here's the pitch. Now a swing and a miss, and he's behind one and two. When I broke into the league, not many guys were throwing that elevated fastball with that much velocity on it. The game has changed. Throw on to first in time, so the leadoff man is set down to open up inning number eight. Into the box now, Gregory Polanco. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. The 1-1 home. Misses, ball two. Doolittle. A rare South Dakota-born ball player. He's currently on a one-year deal, so he stands to be a free agent at the end of this season. You know, Matty, I know he's in the final year of his contract, but he's playing to expectations, to be honest with you. I know he, need, he wants to turn it up a little bit, though, as he approaches the end of the season and make that salary push as he heads towards free agency again. Fouled off. Got him, and he goes down on strikes for the third time. Now Stepping back. in, Kevin Kramer. He's two for three and looking for more here. The 1-1 one, one home is a swinging strike on the slider. One pitch away from wrapping up a very good innings work out of the bullpen here. Waved at and missed for the third out. Not much of a chance at hitting that one, and the inning is over. Wait, Nick Birdie is in out of the bullpen now as he'll be inserted into the number six spot following the double switch. Gerard Dyson is into the ball game as well as he'll slide into the pitcher's spot, hitting ninth now on the double switch. Gerard Dyson. He ties him up with a fastball inside, one and two. Hey, hats off to the pitching staff right here. They've been able to hold a hot hitter in check in game four of this series. Throw on to first is in time to get him, so that'll go down as a strikeout and a two to three put out for out number one. In now as Drupal Cabrera has got a hit in three at bats to this point. Here now the two two. 
right side and right into the shift. Oh, and it eats him up a bit. Digging in to try it again. Ryan Zimmerman. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Now the one and one pitch. He'll be fine coming out of the bullpen in this one if he can keep the ball around the knees like that. Way inside with that one, a pretty easy take there. Everything this guy throws moves, and that two seamer has a mind of its own. Now a fastball is lifted into the air to shallow center. Reynolds comes on now and makes the catch in shallow center for round number two. You're Victor Robles please. will look for some two out magic that. here as he'll pinch hit with two gone 15. and a runner at first. Victor. Two out with a man at first. And he lays off, ball four. So he comes right off the bench and works the walk. Usually easier said than done. Now back to the top of the lineup, stepping in, Trey Turner. It's been a two for four effort for him so far in the ball game. A little behind on that swing, and now he'll try to shorten up maybe and protect the plate. Hit down the third baseline. And this gets right through him, and that may be a run. And he's going to score with ease as the throw will be too late. The center fielder, number two, Adam. At the plate, Adam Eaton. Swing and a liner. But a good play by the first baseman to spear this one, and that'll retire the side. Will Harris comes on from the pen, hoping to finish this one off here in the top of the ninth. Riding in once again, Jacob Stallings. 0 for 2 for him to this point. They look like they're up against it here. Down 3 on the road, trying to come back against the closer. 1-1. One, one. I got 2-1 to count. Hit back up the middle. And this will make its way into center field for a base hit and the leadoff man support now to open the ninth. Now batting, right Gerard Dyson. Standing in now, Gerard Dyson fouled away. The 3 2 one more time. Line hard toward right center, and that's in there. Base hit. Now back, second base, Kevin Newman. Stepping in now, Kevin Newman, and it's fouled away. The one two. Hey, this isn't going to be an easy save. These guys are making it work for this one. The two two. In the dirt here. The runners will hold tight, but it's a full count now. Three and two. Swing and a liner. Foul. Boy, good cutting action to that pitch as that's the first out of the inning. And now to the plate, Adam Frazier. He's roped a couple of doubles in three trips to this point. The 2-1. Three and one here. You have to make a good pitch on the mound. Grooving one here rarely works in your favor unless the hitter tries to do too much with it. And the good fastball there finds the zone as the count goes full now. Three and two. A 
and he misses with it ball four so that'll load the bases and now he's really going to need to get a ground ball so the next to the plate for Pittsburgh Brian Reynolds 0 for 4 with a strikeout thus far a swing and he pops him up on the infield and the infield fly rule will be in effect here so now it'll be the four hole hitter Josh Bell he comes to the plate as the last chance for his side two out here in the ninth Pittsburgh down to their last strike still one and two as he fouls it away and now this crowd estimated at around 26,000 fans comes to their feet Still a ball and two strikes. Has them down to their final strike. Here it comes. Got to take advantage of that pitch right there. 0 2 breaker hanging over the heart of the plate. Not going to see too many of those today. Another one sent foul. Hey, having a B right here, I know it's frustrating the heck out of the pitcher. You keep fouling these pitches off, maybe one misses over the heart of the plate. One, two is the cut fastball, but he holds back two and two. This is exactly the reason why this guy has been so successful and has played this game so long, scrambling pitch after pitch, making this guy work out on the mound. Here's the payoff pitch. Now a swing and a fly ball. And this should do it. And he will make the catch to wrap this one up. And the Nationals have run their winning streak to five in a row now as this ball game is over. Well, they say you should aim to win three out of four at home. But they sweep the four-game series and give this home crowd a lot to cheer about. Bring on the next guys. 7-4 the final finish today. Washington took the lead in the second inning and rode that until the very end. Max Scherzer earns his sixth winning decision in this one. Mitch Keller permitted six earned runs to come across in the losing effort. Will Harris closes the door for the save, his 18th. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vasquez, and you've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com. The final line score for our ball game this afternoon for the victorious Washington Nationals. Seven runs on 12 hits. No errors. They left eight men on base. For the Pirates, four runs on 10 hits. One error. They left nine men on base. Time of the ball game, three hours and 32 minutes. Thank you for joining us here this afternoon. And we remind you to please drive home safely.